What's good? It's your boy Shot Shooter, aka J Shields, back with another video. My favorite videos to do. Um, nuke top fives. Shout out to him. Um, top five or top skin, top ten. Sorry, oh, scary ghost videos to run sleepy time. Okay. To ruin sleepy time. I can't. I'm I'm tired. I'm tired today, y'all. Uh, let's get it. Top 10 ghosts caught on camera. Lurking in the woods. Justin Fender's TikTok account is dedicated to cars, bikes, do-it-yourself projects, and his family. Absolutely nothing paranormal or supernatural. However, three months ago, Justin bought himself a 2002 Nissan Xterra and filmed himself as he installed brand new reverse lights. Today, I'm putting some rear LED lights on my Nissan Xterra. These are the flush mount LEDs I bought off of eBay. They're pretty cheap. The lights are installed. I'm gonna take them back out and paint the bumper. So one of Justin's viewers asks how well the reverse lights work at night and Justin drives out into the dark woods near a lake in North Carolina to show just how bright the lights are. His TikTok viewers are shocked when the reverse lights illuminate something downright chilling. The lights are definitely functional, but unfortunately I live in a city and there are street lights everywhere, but I can find a place to go test them. Okay, I found some really dark woods. I just put some tin foil Bro, over the reverse lights. Woods. So I'm gonna show you what the stock reverse lights look like and then I'm gonna uncover them and show you what the added reverse lights look like. These are the stock reverse lights. Literally can't see anything. And these are the ones I just installed. Yo. Look how friggin' bright that is. This is amazing. Yeah, so these are not just for looks. I saw that thing Did behind the tree. It? As Justin turns on the lights, an arm wrapped around a tree can be seen sliding its way slowly out of sight. After many comments from freaked out viewers, Justin finally sees the arm and decides to go back to investigate during the day. Okay, I'm leaving work. Two blocks that way is where the arm was. Well, at least he did it in daytime. Okay, this road goes down to the lake, which is right there in a public boat landing. This is where my truck was backed in. Well, it's actually a path, and that There's is the tree. the tree with the stick leaned up against it. As you can see, people illegally dump stuff out here all the time. Mostly trash, but a lot of animal carcasses too. And this is the tree. Someone yeah, must have died the right there. It's where my exterior was back then. I'm about 5'10". I'm not a very superstitious person, so you're not gonna get much out of me. I just think, you know, if anything, you know, somebody back here. Now, even after all of that, Justin still believes the arm simply could have belonged to someone that happened to be out in the dark woods. But what do you think? Could it be a creature, a ghost, or perhaps even creepier? Is it just someone hiding in the dark woods? Let me know down in the comments. Cries from beyond. Oh no, that's creepy. This next video was sent in by even for somebody Peter Canova. trying to scare somebody Peter in the middle of the night. Email that his wait. friend was remodeling a house in, in Des Moines, dark. Iowa that had been abandoned for over 10 years. Peter's friend shared a chilling video that was recorded by a tile installer named Javier. In broad daylight. I'm getting paranoid. Está acabo de rellenar, hicimos ese shower y esto. Desde hace rato vengo escuchando un un llanto como de niño. Pero el pedo es de que aquí en la casa esta. Why is it so fainted? Uh, I was about to say the basement. 
claro que voy a dejar. Deja checar. Porque allá afuera no hay nada. Check the basement, bro. They always in the... What the... Hola. Yo, that sh is loud. Wait, what? Wait, no mames. No mames. Wait, 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 wait. Did he see something else? No mames. The loud cries it's of a child locked. can be heard coming from the basement. Javier checks every room but finds no one. Suddenly, there's an unexplained loud bang from somewhere and Javier makes a run for it. Javier refuses to ever return to the house again. He couldn't open the door. Wait, no mames. Before we move on to the next video, if you see anything that you think should be included in the top five, Bro, that just contact gave me us chills, at newstop5 at gmail.com. Oh dear. Terence Leano from Windsor, Ontario, Canada often goes out into the woods to record himself overtone singing for TikTok and YouTube. One day he decides to stream live, and as he starts to sing, he seems to capture the attention of a passing deer. Pretty sure he was looking for where the sound was coming from, but I stopped and started talking and now he's confused. Alright. What is that ghost and thing? And there's the deer, but what? did you see it? Terrence seems to have caught the attention of something else lurking in the woods. Several strange, slim figures seem to be hiding in the trees behind the deer. Terrence's TikTok viewers believe the mysterious creatures could be cryptids, Sasquatch, or even skinwalkers. But what do you think Terrence's Bro, I remember that could have summoned from the deep Canadian woods? doorway. This next bizarre clip comes from a small YouTube channel that is not even necessarily dedicated to ghost hunting or the supernatural. Hey, that's one thing about like There's Rain and Jenna post cameras. random videos to they their personal see things channel that we Sinister cannot see and RP. it's scary just These videos knowing range you from in a room and, music and to your their camera own personal up. passion, which is exploring haunted places. Now Rain and Jenna do not claim that they are quote professional ghost hunters. In fact, they are a bit skeptical themselves, and they even invite their viewers to debunk any paranormal evidence that they find. When we go out, we don't always find the craziest stuff. I mean, let us know. I mean, let us know what you think, you know what I mean? Uh, by all means, if we can debunk this, I would love to be able to, and if we can't, I mean, I'd love that even more. But there is one video in particular that even the couple and their YouTube viewers cannot explain. First. The couple captures some odd sounds in this I abandoned could never farmhouse. Do that. This time, we ended up uh, capturing something else, something really weird. No matter how much money I'm getting, I, I can't be in the ghost room. What? If you heard a squeak, I was. Uh, no, I heard a bang. Hello? Not much else happens. But then, by accident, the couple captures this. What? What? What happened? I didn't see anything. Did you see it? 
It, the door. Some dark humanoid shape seems to appear near the door, and then quickly moves away and disappears into nothing. Rain and Geno try to debunk the figure, and even invite their audience to do the same. Now, of course, uh, the first thing that's running through my head is, mm, that might be one of her shadows, but... And that's what's still been going through my head, but I don't know, you know, everybody else now is saying, that's not, that's not your shadow, that has its own movement to it. Yes, and... it do. And if you watch, I move and it stays still, and then it moves and disappears. But there is just no rational explanation. So, what do you think? Check out this full Tough. video over on the YouTube channel, Sinister RP. Urban Exploration Gone Wrong Urban Explorer Andy Persons heads out to Albany, New York to see the old Tobin's First Prize Center, which is a meatpacking facility that was built in 1924 and was later left completely abandoned. That's the building. Together you with his two friends, he makes his way through the me. massive old crumbling factory and he discovers something truly that unnerving. That whole floor crumbles on you. It's they just might a done not deal. be the only ones there. This is the fun part. See? Bro, if them stairs go, y'all done. So this is where things kind of got a little weird. We were coming down these staircases and I shined my flashlight to the left and out of the corner of my eye, all I could see was someone in a black trench coat quickly rush over through the door and hide in the corner. looking at him. I shine my flashlight down the elevator shaft that was right next to me and all of a sudden we all started hearing a bunch of voices and just people that were inside of the walls. I want a whole bunch of brave people we that just, just don't to get care. Out there pretty quickly and, and let them be. A man who seems to be wearing a dark trench coat quickly disappears out of sight. Then the group hears voices coming from the walls all around them. Just don't them. care what's Spooked going on. Stay event, in there to see to what actually happened. I don't want now, no one to get in danger by a spirit, but... but I'm not sure. But as I've said before, sometimes real people are much more frightening. Anyway, man, you can some, watch the man, entire just, exploration of I'll, this creepy man, abandoned factory the over on the YouTube channel. And the person thumping through the looking glass. Like a group of people just one still night, stay in there no matter Apple what the spirit Castro for decides to weigh herself on a scale in her family home in the Philippines. She stands in front of a mirror and what happens next is truly bizarre. Philippine, Chinese, Japanese man. That mirror is not functioning. And why is she looking down doing that? Y'all didn't see that? Apple's reflection in the mirror seems to move out of time with her body. Now, of course, this could just be a weird CCTV compression glitch, but her brother Joshua actually sees it happen with his own eyes. Another camera angle records his reaction. I need to stop denying this shit. It's real. Joshua 
Joshua can't believe what he's seeing and he quickly goes to warn his sister. Together, they check the footage recorded by their CCTV cameras and post their creepy experience to TikTok. So could this be a glitch in the matrix? A haunted mirror? Or just a really, really strange camera glitch? Why was she over As there always, going back and forth I leave anyway? I it to you to decide. Looking at her toes. No entry. As with most Japanese videos, I have no idea what the source is for this next creepy clip. The clip shows two no. guys approaching an old school building that is under renovation and is allegedly haunted. Even though there's tape at the entrance saying no entry, the two friends step inside anyway. What happens next is absolutely no entry terrifying. for a reason. Boy, I'm paranoid. もう<笑> <laughs> yeah, y'all happy now. Yo, I, th I think I just seen somebody. Yo, right there, look in the top right, bro. The top right, ain't that something right there? Yo, something following y'all. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh. Okay, never mind. Y'all talking about construction site, a normal conversation in this creep. A mysterious woman wearing a white dress silently approaches the two friends from the darkness. She seems to have no visible arms. The two guys run in fear and scream for help. What happens next, we'll just never know. And whether the footage is real or not, that's up for you to decide. Either way, them ghosts the with the long hair, bro, in Chinese and Japanese, bro, the scariest this next spooky video was seen by bro. Nuke's top five viewer Zoe from Perth, Australia. Zoe says that she's a registered nurse working the night shift at a nursing home. She That's says wrong, that there is one particular room in the job. nursing home that gives the entire staff the creeps. The staff says that they feel watched while in the room and that the room often feels extremely cold for no reason. Some have even witnessed chairs moving around by themselves. One night, Zoe and the rest of the staff are gathered in the Old office when they notice something they very die strange on the CCTV. I'm out. I'm not working there no more. There's no way somebody can w float walk. That was in thin air, bro. The lights in the room start to flicker and dim in a bizarre pattern. And then some dark shape seems to pass in front of the camera, not once, but twice. Now, could this be something paranormal or just a strange lighting malfunction? And just what are those two dark shapes? Tell me what you think. The Boy Next Door Paranormal investigators K&L from the YouTube channel K&L Ghost Hunters spend the night at the historic Red Lion Hotel in Colchester, England. 
Built way back in 1465, it's no surprise that the hotel has a long history of tragic events Not and paranormal old. activity. Just to give one example, several hundred years ago, a horrible fire ravaged the hotel and took the lives of several young children. These days, it's said that the spirit of a young boy wanders the restaurant of the hotel. He is often seen and photographed by guests. Most of all, the spirit of the young boy is often seen by children. K and L leave a static Bro, camera to record in the restaurant as they investigate the basement of the hotel. As grown Later, folks. when they check their footage, they are shocked by what they've caught. Just like animals can see ghosts and stuff. Okay. A small head about the height of a young child can be seen peeking through the glass windows of one of the restaurant doors. Paranormal investigators K and L believe that they might have captured the spirit of the young boy that guests claim to have seen over the years. But what do you think this small figure could be? Let me know. Oh, that was you can watch this chilling. entire investigation and many more over on the YouTube channel K and L Ghost Hunters. Dead in the water. In another strange video shared to the internet without a source, Someone can be seen taking off their shoes after having walked through a waterfall in Malaysia and discovering small clumps of leeches stuck to their feet. And if no. that isn't horrifying enough, right. there's something else in this video that's very disturbing. The leeches managed to get in there. Yo, she's standing in the water, bro. Did you see it? Someone or something can be seen sitting on a rock inside the waterfall. Whoever or whatever it is appears to be wearing a white dress and has long dark hair and dark arms. Chinese, Japanese. Now, without a source, it's impossible person. to establish yeah. whether this footage is real, fake, or even explainable. But let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Thanks so much for watching my upload schedule. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Help it grow. I hope y'all sleep after this because a couple of them gave me the chills.